All right, what's up guys? As always, welcome back to another most likely know your game versus silver. And finally, we have the milk tank week. Um, finally got that right. Uh, I had, couldn't really decide on what to use. Uh, I just wanted to use a milk tank and the rest kind of are fillers. And look, I like this team. Bes besides the whole... Oh! <laughs> the, oh! But besides that, like, there are a lot of things that Creever might... Choice Bandit, mil or mil I was gonna say, Choice Bandit, monster that is uh, Swampet can do. We also have a defog variant of um, Dragonite, which is gonna be really great for this battle, as it can deal with everything besides, well, let's face it, besides that freaking bronze sound, which looks phenomenal for this matchup. Uh, so kind of does Helios. I think it does, it, come in, it comes in naturally, you can switch out versus the major threats, and we'll take things from there. And also, my milk maker, milk tank, is not thick fat, which will make ho o -Oh all the more threatening, really. It all depends on which variant it is of um, Ratchet, uh, of the um, ho -Oh, but like if it is a power herb with solar beam, then um, I think it's gonna keep it at arm's length. So I think I get a great lead. I have at least an option to, um, well, bolt switch out. But um, I have every reason to think it's gonna go for Stealth Rocks, and we do some okay damage. So I could Void, I think. But then again, I have nothing to kind of chip away. I'm gonna bring in Creever and to just get as much damage in as possible. Don't mind the rocks, or I kind of do, but I don't have to. It's a Trick Room team. This will make it. A lot more scarier. Only positive trait with that is that um, Waterfall is kind of free. Uh, there is no way out speed, and I do know Bronson can get Grass Nod. So it's a bit of a risk. Hypnosis. Who connects Hypnosis anyway? 55%. What a mad lad. I like the combination of Trick Room and, um, and Hypnosis, though. I think that could open up the game a little bit for my opponent. Uh, gets can stay in a bit more. Let's we'll see. He has heavies. Okay, so this is not going great for him. That's not gonna work, buddy. That's not gonna work. What's that? Shell bell. All right, still asleep. Still halfway giant. Um. So heavy slammer. You know, I kind of miss the body body press environment right now. That, that was a phenomenal option for it. Let's see, goes to Sky Warden. Oh yeah, this guy eats me alive. Am I locked in? Don't wake up, don't wake up. If I'm not locked in to Waterfall, I can go for an Avalanche. I've yet to make the move after all. Draco meets, ooh, it's gonna sting. How much will you do? Uh, at least we'll make one more of those. All right, Creever, it is time. It is time to wake up. Oh, oh, piece of shit. <laughs> All right, let's go. My body is ready, and now I outspeed. Probably nothing though, but I do outspeed. Pull the wall. All right, that's gonna be a thing. So I think I can switch in my Yoldir here. Mainly because of the Earthquake. I have every reason to think he can. Like, even his best moves shouldn't hurt me. Like, what? Metal Burst? Yeah. Please. So he's gonna break his sturdy with an Ice Beam. Like a boss. <laughs> hey! Metal Burst me, buddy. Metal Burst me. Thanks. Don't have leftovers. Because I have. Ah, ah. Ah, ah. All right, let's take him out. My turn, buddy. Now, peace out. <laughs> no, wait, what? No, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Um. Well, how about that? <laughs> all right, all right, cool, cool, nice. Huh. 
Huh. Alright, Paul. Alright. I see ya. I see ya. This is strange. This is very strange, honestly. Gonna re-break his 30. I've, I, I kinda have to switch out, I guess, to Bronson or something like that, but... I'll take it. <laughs> it was the strangest scenario I've been in. It, it really was. Alright, Ice Beam this. Yeah, we're fine. He's probably gonna recover more for Leftovers, honestly. Um. Alright, he had Shell Bell, I remember. I also remember he's probably gonna go for Hypnosis this time. Um, Swampet is still like super solid, so let's go with that. Still can't Quake, really. So, let's see... Yep, here goes the Trick Room again. Five turns of Madness. But he can't miss the Hypnosis, right? That's a thing. You wanna miss it. Withdraws, I, I guess that's fair. Goes into... A tree ground. All right. He's got to be massively slow, though. He has intimidate, not technician. So, not too worried. Or, or I mean, I'll lose. Like it's not that damaging. Oh, it's a two-hit kill. Is the citrus gonna screw that over? No. It what? Ah, Japoka berry. Cool. Hurts when you hit me. Can bring in Joel there again. Says it doesn't have triple axle, like, what can it do? Stone Edge, I guess? Earthquake? Close combat would be nice, but... Yeah. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. And I'm pretty sure I can kill you from here. Now, do I have to risk it? You can always carry Stone Edge. I'll try to roost. Hopefully... Like, we, we clearly are. Like, he should be faster. <laughs> In the trick room, that is. Alright. Bone Crusher. Yeah, that's surprisingly right. That's a good name for it. Only positive thing here is that I actually have my Marvel scale now intact. So I should be able to stomach a hit. Uh, I'm just gonna double check my ability. Yeah, multi scale. That, that's what I meant. So, Ice Beam here, should be able to take a Stone Edge. Not good. But just, you know, enough. I'll die to the next one, for sure. Oh, he is Life Orb, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Let's go! Mm. That's right! And I'm pretty sure Trick Room ends here. Yep. So, Roost once. Keep my multi-scale. I really love Defensive Dragonite when it works. I really do. <laughs> yep. Let, let, me, let me help you with that. Let me help you with that. <laughs> really, let me help you with that. No! That's so close. Here, here we go again. Multi-scale is saving me once again. Bye. Alright. Let's see. I have yet to use Milk Tank, of course, but... Like, the scariest money got left is... This guy, right? Yeah, no. How do I avoid this guy? It, like, it's strange, but I think my Milkmaker is sadly... I don't want to sack play, I really don't, but I kind of have to. Like, Sacred Fire is going to absolutely dent me. Or that works. Call Mind. Alright, so at least we have ways to outspeed him. That's a good type of play, really. Um, I'm Body Slamming here, hoping for Para. Um, Sacred Fire... It's gonna hurt. Not as much as I thought, though. But the burn is a thing. So Bonnie Slam will not do anything. However, Para! Yes! Just sometimes it's not even. Uh, 
I don't know, the games cannot just uh, say, yeah, re remember me? Remember hacks? Yeah, I do. So I think we can... Like, we're clearly loose in this matchup. But at least Milk Tank can do two things very good here. He can set up rocks, pretty much denying it of everything, and uh, die. A graceful death. Now, Calm Mind is um, mildly annoying. I'll give you guys that. Because it gotta have roost. And I mean, I can just pay, like hope for the cripple, right? I kinda need him to just eat my mon. Strange as it sounds. Can't switch in Creever, hoping gets greedy or fully paralyzed. Or a quick law, you know, why not? <laughs> it's like, just so you know, once you switch in, you will get hurt. Not really. Not really. Alright, so gonna hope for an not a quick claw next turn, right? Ah. Uh, this is this is not great. Come on, buddy. No quick claw, that's right! That's fucking right! Para or flinch. Or nothing of it, why not? We can stomach that. Don't get burned. That's right! So quick law. Come on! <laughs> Come on, ho! Show me what you got, sucker! I am all over your face. Oh nay. Nay 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 Fuck! <laughs> Ten percent right, right. Yeah, I see it. Um, I wonder. Like, I have Agron as a backup plan. But I really, I really just want to try to, try to exchange some damage here and not wrap it up with it. Right? You die to this. No. No. What? No. This is not great. This is not great. Um. Ah, oh, it's not great. Alright, Optimus, I gotta hope he gets greed and recovers some more, nice. Now I gotta hope for, first, no quick loss sacred fire, I can live one of those, but and then also not get burned. Um, quick law, of course, of course! Oh, no! Oh, took it like a champ though! Come on, Agron! Yes! Fucking yes! Piece of shit! Oh... Damn, Agron really came through. You really came through there. Oh... What are you now, anyway? Do I need Agron? I can't remember the remaining months. I didn't even think Ho was gonna be a threat. Jokes on me, really. Um, well, Jolir has good, been doing good enough so far, so why not keep going at it? I think, what is Mon? Bronsong, um, Bastudon, and this guy is left. Should be able to avoid all of them. To some capacity. I also have every reason to think he has Stone Edge. Rapid spin, close combat, like, what are the filler moves of a Hitman top? Besides pain. Come on, buddy. You are right now in a position, I would say, um, whoops. <laughs> Work up. That's not terrifying. Let's see, how much will a Rapid Spin do, or Ice Beam do anyway? That looks fine. It looks fine.
It looks fine. Sucker punch! Ooh. Nope. Nip 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 nip. I really like like how the Dragonite works in the game. However, Hobo would just have stomped all over this Dragonite. It definitely was a setup fodder. So I'm kinda glad I avoided that scenario. Even though I kinda did end with Swamp but failing to kill it. Should probably lock myself in the stone edge thinking about it, but you know. In hindsight, everything uh, I kind of wish I did better. Um, now he will, of course, set up the trick room again, and I think my best scenario here is just setting, or sending in my Rotom and uh, really just thinking what would be the best play, because I think his Bastion is phenomenal. It it really will be. Um, discharge him because it is a safer of the options. Who connects hypnosis anyway? Don't, like, who? One second... He's two for two! I I barely get Focus Blast to pull that off. Let alone... <laughs> Extra sensory. Uh, I mean, you're not gonna hurt me. That's the thing. That, that is what bothers me, is that he really isn't... A threat. Theoretically, of course. Um... I just, I want to speed this up, besides ruining probably my win con. Let's see, Heavy Slam, gonna be resisted, really not gonna do anything here. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Wake up, Rotom. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, that did alright. So I'm just gonna play with the idea here. Um, like I said, I kind of want to wrap up this game. I mean, with 17 minutes left, I need Tassadar to not die to a Heavy Slam? Is that even possible? Or even worse, he goes for another Hypnosis. He just decided to attack. Nice. And... Tassadar is bulky! <laughs> I guess not. But here we go. Shadow Ball. Gonna pop him. Uh, we of course Life Orb, because I've seen people use the Focus Sash variant, and while I do think it's good, I see no reason for using it myself. However... However... The damage was definitely enough for me of not being able to capitalize on um, my substitute. So, we're hoping for that Focus Blast. He's still asleep. I miss, of course. Don't have Sleep Powder. Or Rest Talk, no. I miss one Focus Blast. Can I miss two? Yeah, but he, but he connects, by the way. He connects two Hypnosis, but I can miss two Focus Blasts in a row. That's, that's fair. Can I miss three? Nice. Nice. I love this game. Woo. Yeah, that helps. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep going for it. Whatever. Eventually, I should connect it. Yes, one double theme was, that was detrimental. That, that's what you get. Second you set up double team, here's the second we hit the focus blast. That looks about right. Flamethrower! I'm pretty sure it's skills. No! Still in it. And I can still miss. Yes! Yeah! Stir to this sucker. <laughs> Alright, Silver. Very much GG, what a fantastic, awful game. Fucking ho. Uh, and for everyone watching, hope you enjoyed this game. It was kinda close, too, wasn't it? Uh, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, as always, take care of one, right?